how's it going everybody so what do we have here we have a juvenile slipper lobster i saw this off negros island in the philippines on one of these amazing muck diving sites muck diving where you just look around in the sand or you know in the muck and then you find animals like this so for instance this is a mantis shrimp another crustacean this one is staying in its burrow and it's a lie in weight predator you can see it's very actively moving eyes and you can see these black dots which are pseudopapilla on the eyes so this is a predatory animal usually it makes do with very little light essentially from the moon and it would grab something like a cardinal fish which would swim by and feed itself like that so this is the charm of muck diving the sand 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 and then there's an alien like this amazing stuff now another crustacean this is a crinoid squat lobster so this animal is at the bottom of a crinoid which is an echinoderm a relative of the sea stars a filter feeder and it lives its whole life on this crinoid now there are also interesting fishes this is a ambon scorpion fish which is a very rare scorpion fish which looks somewhat like a ball of algae so highly camouflaged now we have a lot of sea slugs when we muck dive and this is a pleurobranch so it's not a nudibranch like so many other sea slugs and it's pleuropanchia brocchi and this is the first time that i had seen this animal now what you very often get is that when they are encountering a dive light a video light like obviously what you have to have at night then they would hide under the sand if it's too bright for them so this is a reflex which also shows you know where they are during the day so they are, they're just hidden a couple of centimeters under the sand so there's this whole fauna at night which you never see when you only dive during the day and another thing you see very well in this video is that these days so this i recorded in october 2022 the, the crustaceans are so dense in the water column and they're also attracted to my video light so they're bouncing around the sea slug you know they're hitting my camera they're hitting the sand so there's a real crustacean storm now this is another pleurobranch and here we're looking at oiselinops luniceps and very interesting animal Sometimes when I film the sea slugs, I would shoot a couple of minutes of footage and then I would just speed it up so that they seem to be moving faster. That's not what I did here. So this is the real speed. So this is a sprinter among the sea slugs. It's unclear to me why these animals move so fast. And very interesting how you can see the undulations on the foot of this gastropod mollusk, how it's gliding over the sand. And again, you see a massive, massive crustacean storm. Now, I hope you enjoyed this. As usual, please like, subscribe, leave a comment and share these videos on your social media, please. I hope to see you next week with more footage from underwater, from Negros Island in the Philippines and have a great day.